everybody, let's let's review the Lego Carnival um, mixer Lego set. Now, where is the mixer? It seems like it's running late a tiny bit. Anyway, in the meantime, let's review the rest of the set, shall we? So first, you get this little um girl with her teddy bear. Um, get this person over here. It's a girl, by the way. Um, you get this girl inside here selling all the tickets. iPads are very hard to move around. You get this girl here. Got the same hair as Cardio. No, that's not her. She's got the uh, same hair as Cardio Carry, but in like um, pinky, pinky color. Um, if you don't know who Cardio Carry is, she's from the Lego Movie Ice Cream Truck, which I'm also going to be reviewing another time. Um, and the garbage truck, and probably some plunger van. That's a different story. Um, and there's also this mini kid. I love these new caps, by the way, because there's so much you can do with them. Because this is um, Garbage Man Dan from um, the Lego Garbage Truck with a couple of extra things on. Put this headset on. It's the same type of cap, so you can get one of these little mini Lego headsets. And you can put it on the cap, and it actually looks pretty cool. It's how they uh, did it in the Lego movie. Um, it came out in the Lego City line. Lego City lines. Um, first, and then they decided... Then they decided to use it in the Lego movie. Since, um, like, at the start, it's all about construction. They're at the construction site. They would have a big opportunity to use those in there. Um, also we get this dunk tank lady, my dunk tank, um, it's supposed to work, it doesn't really work for me, all that happens is that like the wind blows in a direction and she completely falls off and bangs her head off the door, but still that's a different story, anyway, um, and then you get these two minifigures, um, guy who's about puke, that's, um, it's got two faces, one where he's about to puke, really see that well because my camera's not focusing um and then you've also got a smiley face he's um the same that's the smart same smiley face as i use for my minifigure um it's also got a second head on it but that's like a crying face i never use that um then we've got this golden server dude and then we've got this uh, guy who wants this truck um, and all of these, these, this, this, and this go onto that truck, and I'll show you that later uh, in the episode, if not in another episode. Um, and then there's this guy who's trying to be Lord Business. That is Lord Business, my friends. The guy in red and black, Mr. Business of the Lords. He's doing a very bad job at pretending to be Lord Business. So yeah, um, now let's go on to the small stands. So the dunk tank, like I said, it can either not work for you or it can work for you. It depends how good you are at Lego building. Apparently it says to me that I'm terrible at Lego building. But whatever, I've just um, built a 16 plus Lego set and I'm only 11, but who cares. Anyway, so this is a little dunk tank. You get this is not the correct way to put the stickers on. You can arrange them however you want. It's supposed to go dunk tank sign over this side and the fish over that side. I did it the wrong way. Um, so yeah, just because I want to. Then you got the little balls to hit this, and then the lady's supposed to fall down. But then again, that d that doesn't work for mine. Um, then you've got this little hammer stand, hit that and you win a prize. So you got your big hammer for the people, the real life people who made the Lego set. I'm doing terrible. Wait, I'll swap hands. There, that's better. Wow. There, I got the prize. Um, so you can do it. But there's also a hammer for the minifigure to do it as well. So yeah, that's quite a fun one. Oop, I've just snapped it. 
<laughs> Lol, my bad. My bad. And then also got this ticket booth, tickets booth. And you can apparently close it on that lady's head. Well, you can close it in for it to fold. There's not much about this one except the cash register's got a cool printed piece. And also these two drawers open up. Like how I've got on the Ock truck. Which, if you don't know what the Ock truck is, it's my Sig Fig commu community type thing. But it's mainly for my stop motions, and that's coming soon. I've not got it in, in any video yet, but I'm still gonna. Not sure if I'm gonna do the Sig Figs or what. Anyway, now let's uh, have a look at this truck. Ah, this truck! got two pegs here a hole in um hole in there you can guess that for the end of the video um put your comments in the description what you think these will be used for what you think that'll be used for and i will show you at the end of the video um now if you look inside the cabin well you've got first off you've got a brush and a shovel on the side um inside the cabin you've got um a coffee mug why is that in every Lego set that has a car, why is there always a coffee mug? I mean, seriously. Lego, you've overdone it this time. And you've got the steering wheel and you've got the chair. Yeah, there's not much to this apart from the fact that it's got space to put stuff in. Anyway, oh, it looks like the mixer has arrived. And I've just ripped the top off it. The mixer has just arrived. Let's see how we get this mixer. Go away balloon cars, that'll be in another video. Let's see how we get this mixer um, apart. So let's set this down here. So first you've got to disconnect the mixer itself from the front of the truck. Now first let's um, review the front of the truck. That's the thing that makes the uh, mixer itself go around. Uh, inside the truck there's a bed and two seats. So the beds for a, a minifigure need some rest. And then the two seats are for the... You can have up to three characters in here. Um, they can be... Oh. Ah. That's fell off. I'll uh, fix that later. There's supposed to be another one of these on that side. Yeah, I'll fix that later. Oops. Um, lol. Anyway, so you can have a bed, and then you have a character in here and a character in here. Um, if you have two characters, um, your character who's in the steering wheel might want to go to bed, and then this character will drive in here. So yeah, that's pretty cool. I like how they've thought about that. And now is what you've all been waiting for. The... The Grand Mixer has came to said to town. So as you see, I've just folded this down. Um, that's the ladder for the minifigures to get on. Now let's hope this doesn't completely fall apart because um, I've showed the rest of my family and every time I've done it, it's fallen apart. Like the whole thing's just fell flat on the floor. Let's hope it doesn't do it this time. Oh yeah, first you need to take this Technic pin out the back. I don't even know what this is called. Technic rod with four pokies on it. I don't know. Yeah, and then you take this big crate out. Uh, this is for later. Right, so, uh, let's see. So you get the blue one and you put the blue one over into that corner and it just clicks it's like in a couple of clicks it will fix together and you do the same for the yellow one and now you put this these down you can't stand up to for in order for it to go together so you just get that and you go bam and then do that for all three of them. Now I've got to move it, lolcats. Backwards. 
Um, then you get this that you had before with the little thing on, and you put it in here, and you clip it in so that it, you now have a rod from that yellow piece over there to that yellow piece over there. Now you get your get you get back your van, your truck, and you take off this big box. You take off this little rubbish bin let's let that other guy be sick in it you remember the sick guy um and then yeah you've got this little crank box currently has no use but then you clip this part in here and then you lift up this part and it'll just click you heard that click the sound of clicking and then you know that crank that I showed you before? This one? Spin that and it goes. That's um if you go down to the woods today. It's like if you go down to the woods today, you're in for a big surprise. But that's another story. We currently wanting to review this Lego set, and yes, I have just fixed that thing not just destroyed it completely anyway so this is like a little thing somebody operates this you move this along um yeah that's cool you put this up if you want to fold it back in i'm not folding this back in by the way guys so i'm not going to show you how to fold it in that comes with the instruction manual i'll probably um flick through the backs of the instruction manual that actually shows you how to put it back in but anyway yeah that's it's got very good detailing and each one of these holds one character just one not two just the one anyway probably is wondering what this and the garbage truck are for so you take this out of here like like that and you have this big two sets of big fencing long fencing um and then you see that little clip down here you clip one end into here <coughs> oh sorry guys i got a bad cough so now let's move this around and then you get your dustbin And then you put that there, and then because that clips in, and then you get your other piece, and then you clip that into the dustbin piece. And then there is another one of those little claw pieces on the other side, the little yellow claw pieces, and you connect that into there like that. Um, and yeah, you almost have a perfect circle. Um, but yeah, I mean, honestly, sometimes you can get one, sometimes you can't. And guys, it looks like, um, these, um, Octan Dustbin guys are gonna come along and fix the dustbin. Let's leave them to it. Let's see how all of these extras pack away. So anyway, first off, you gotta get your truck Obsnox. Obviously, you don't know what that means. Then remove all minifigures from all of the stands. Then you get the stand, ticket stand, ticket booth, and then you flap in the ticket sign. See, like that. Um, and then you need to put it on, not so that it's like that, but so that it's like on the edge. And then you need to put that on there. And you need to pop that on there. And then finally, this goes into here. I'm rushing because I'm about to go over my time limit. That goes under there. And then, um, yeah, that's it. You put all the other small things inside of here. And yeah, that's it. See you again next time. We will review the balloon cart next time. Yay!